What's good with y'all, man? You watch it, AGTV, and on this episode, we're breaking the Movado, Delilah, and I feel happy about this one, man. Y'all excited about this one. Y'all got Young Dream Chaser Ellis to thank for this, man. Hey, we got another Movado reaction. You know, last time I did Movado, I was highly impressed. But last time, actually, I said that back. Last time I did Movado, I think he was going against the Vibes Cartel, so I actually didn't react to a, a song of his last time. I was actually reacting to a battle or whatever. Um, and that was the last time I seen Movado, man, but... Other than that, I ain't got too much to say, man. Let's just get into it. Can y'all see me? Delilah. I like how that just came in. Delilah. You know what I'm saying? I like that. You know what I'm saying? I love you to my heart. I love you to my soul. I thought you was for real, but you playing around, like. You feel me? I took you out on dates. You feel me? We've been texting back and forth. I've been sitting on on FaceTime with you for three, four hours straight. It's two in the morning. I'm tired and shit telling you I'm not because I don't want to get off the phone with you because I don't want you to feel like I'm going to sleep on you. You feel me? I'm going to sleep with the phone, with my phone on, uh, fucking, fucking my battery up. You feel me? All because you don't want to hang up because you want to sleep together and shit. But you playing? You feel me? Like, what kind of shit? That's deep. He said lying to me. That's all you do. What'd he say? Fancy. Hold on, hold on. Fancy cars and superstars. That's the thing she chose. This reminds me of that song Kanye dropped a while ago. Uh, she don't believe in shooting stars, but she believe in shoes and cars. You get what I'm saying? Like that's that's what this shit get. That's the vibe is giving me right now. Damn, this this song kind of it give you like a um a clear representation or a clear vision of the dynamic between men and women. And this song came out a long time ago, and it's still relevant today. So you know it's true. If it can cut through all this time and still make sense, cause like he was saying, love is just a lying game between two. Like nine out of ten, who I don't give a fuck what y'all say. Nine out of ten, if you with somebody, you've been with somebody for for a few months. Or you've been with somebody longer than a few months. You've been with somebody for a decent amount of time. You know what I'm saying? Y'all done been on dates. Y'all done made a dessert. In the beginning of y'all relationship, y'all done lied to each other about something. I don't give a fuck what y'all got to say. Y'all done lied to each other about something at some point in time. Just to make it to where y'all at. Because people are not going to accept every single truth. And you know that. There's a lot of women out here. Who will lie to you and say their body count is this when it's really this. It's a lot of niggas out here who will lie to you and say, oh, I ain't fucking with no bitches. But they fucking with bitches. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a lot of that going on out here. It's niggas that'll say, I got this and I got that. And he really ain't got shit. You feel me? Just to, just to prove or to show a woman or to persuade a woman to come fuck with him. You get what I'm saying? And the same go for women. Women, they we do it to each other. Because if we got interest in each other, we gonna lie about something to save the other person's feelings because we don't want them to go nowhere. Or not even because we don't want them to go nowhere, but because we want to get what we want out of the situation at that particular time. You get what I'm saying? So this shit is real right now. I fuck with this song, though.
I got an icebox where my heart used to be. Is a girl. Hold on. She won again a while. Hold on, hold on, hold on. She don't give a lot to nobody else. Where the, where the flow just where that flow just come from, bro? You feel me? I ain't gonna lie. This this is definitely. A banger. You know what I'm saying? This is definitely a hit. You get what I'm saying? This is definitely it. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with this. Nevada, what the fuck, bro? Hold on. I, you just said, you was talking all that shit, and now you want to keep her for yourself. You deserve whatever you got coming at this point. If you know all that shit you just said about her, but you still want to keep her for yourself, you deserve to you deserve to get hurt. You know what I'm saying? You deserve it. Cause you know better, bro. Honestly, at the end of the day, fuck these hoes. Come on. Hey, bro. Let me go, bro. Hey, bro. Let me go, bro. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? She say men are wicked, but women are Delilah's. I fuck with that. I fuck with that. You feel me? I fuck with that. He That literally just described how men and women are today. That lets you know a lot of things really don't change as much as they seem. Things change, but shit really don't change. The world don't make sense. Shit is always changing, but shit never really be changing. If you really think about, do, do, think about that. Don't that not make no sense? Shit is always changing. But shit really don't be changing. Like, if you go watch an old movie, people still be saying some of the same shit. And they still be having the same issues that we having today. As far as amongst each other, we talk to each other the same. Niggas still do the same shit. Women still do the same shit. Women still want the same shit. Besides, niggas still want the same shit. The only thing that changes is women want BBLs and shit now. Nah. And what else, What do niggas be wanting? I don't know. Niggas still just want money, for real, and bad bitches. But that's the only difference, for real, is the whole BBL and shit. All that type of shit and the technology and shit. But if you think about it, shit really don't be changing. Shit be changing, but it don't be changing. Then a new shit that do come into play, it be some shit that the old motherfuckers did back in the day that we reinvented type shit. You feel what I'm saying? But this song crazy, man. I fuck with it heavy, man. I should have been did this. Whoever you is that was commenting this shit for for months and... I almost say years and years. For months and months and, and blowing me up and try, and just... You just never gave up. And you got a you got a, a very good reaction out of me for this. Because I fucked with this song so heavy, bro. But anyway, that's all I got to say, man. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what I'm reacting to next. I'm out.